Unit 4 Tape Script 4.1 Living Room Sofa DVD Player Armchair Bookshelves Mirror Kitchen Cooker Fridge Table Oven Washing machine Street Bus stop Post office Cafe Pavement Chemists Traffic lights Tape script 4.2 A flat to rent Here's a flat in Queen's Road. Is it nice? There's a big living room. Mm hmm. And there are two bedrooms. Great. What about the kitchen? There's a new kitchen. Wow. How many bathrooms are there? Uh, oh, there's just one bathroom. Is there a garden? No, there isn't a garden. It doesn't matter. It sounds great. Tape script 4.3 is there a shower? Yes, there is. Is there a fridge? Yes, there is. Is there a dining room? No, there isn't. How many bedrooms are there? Two. How many bathrooms are there? One. How many armchairs are there? Two. Are there any pictures? No, there aren't. Are there any bookshelves? Yes, there are. Are there any carpets? No, there aren't. Tape script 4.4 Prepositions 1. The flat's in Queen's Road. 2. It's on the first floor. 3. It's above a chemist's. 4. The chemist's is next to a clothes shop. 5. There's a mobile phone shop opposite the clothes shop. 6. There's a post office near the flat. 7. The bus stop is outside the cafe. 8. There's a bench under a tree. Tape script 4.5 the flat's near the centre of town. It has four bedrooms, a lovely living room with views over the town, and two bathrooms. The kitchen is very big, and there's a dining room next to it. The flat's on the second floor. In the living room, there are two sofas and an armchair. There are a lot of pictures on the wall. There's a carpet in front of the fire. And there's a TV and a DVD player. There's a table in front of the sofa. Tape script 4.6 a new flat. 1. She has some plates. 2. She has a lot of clothes. 3. She doesn't have any glasses. 4. She has some pictures. 5. She has a lot of CDs. 6. She doesn't have any mugs. 7. She has a lot of shoes. 8. She doesn't have any towels. 9. She has some cups. Tape script 4.7 This, that, these, those. 1. How much is this lamp, please? It's £45. 2. 
two. I like that picture. Yes, it's lovely. Three. How much are these glasses? They're fifteen pounds. Four. I love those towels. They're fabulous. Five. Look at those flowers. They're beautiful. Six. Do you like this kettle? Yeah, it's a great colour. Seven. How much are these mugs? Five pounds each. Eight. Look at that coat. You don't need any more clothes. <laughs> Tape script four point eight. What's in your bag? What's in my bag? Well, there's my phone and my purse, of course. I have some pens. I always have some pens, a blue one and a red one. And there's my diary. I need to know what appointments I have. And I have a lipstick. Oh, and keys. I have some keys. My house keys and my car keys. And that's all. Tape script four point nine. Describing your home. My new flat. My new flat is near the centre of town, so I often walk to work. It's not very big, but it's very comfortable. There's just one bedroom, a living room, and quite a big kitchen with a table in the centre. This is good because I love cooking, and I can invite my friends to dinner. The living room has one big window. It faces south, so it's always very sunny. I have two comfortable old armchairs, but I don't have a sofa because the room is quite small. There isn't a garden, but there's a small balcony in my bedroom. I want to put a chair there so I can sit in the sun on summer evenings. I love my new flat for many reasons: the big kitchen, the sunny living room, but most of all, I love it because it's my first home. Tape script four point ten. It's wonderful. They're awful. She's fantastic. Tape script four point eleven. One. Do you know Alice has a new boyfriend? Really? Is he okay?、Mm, he's lovely. Oh, what's his name? James. Good for Alice. Two. Ben has a new flat. Wow, where is it? In the center of town. Is it nice? Oh yes, it's fantastic. The living room is fabulous. Three. What a horrible day. Yes, it is. Rain, rain, rain. It's terrible weather at the moment. Oh well, tomorrow's another day. Four. Mmm, this is an excellent meal. Thank you. I am pleased you like it. And the wine is wonderful. Where is it from? I think it's French. Yes, it is French. Five. I love your shoes. They're great. They're nice, aren't they? They're Italian. The colour's amazing. Red. Wow. Six. We have a new teacher. Her name's Nancy. Is she nice? No, she's awful. I hate her. Why? I don't understand her. She talks and talks and talks all the time. Tape script four point twelve. One. Look at Angela's car. It's a Mercedes. Wow, they're really expensive. Is it fast? Very fast. Two. Does Tom have a lot of money? Well, he has a really beautiful house with a very big garden and a swimming pool. Hmm. He's very rich, isn't he? Three. 
Do you like my new jeans? Yeah, they're really nice. What make are they? They're Prada. How much were they? They weren't expensive. Well, not very expensive. Four. Look, that's Peter's new girlfriend. Hmm, she's pretty. How old is she? Twenty-eight. Wow, that's old. Twenty-eight. That isn't very old. Five. Maria's very clever, isn't she? Oh yes, she's really intelligent. She knows everything. Do you like her? No, not really. She isn't very nice to talk to. No, I don't like her either. Tape script four point thirteen. Eight. Ten. Twelve. Fifteen. Twenty. Thirty-two. Forty-five. Sixty. Seventy-six. Ninety-nine. A hundred and eighty-seven. Two hundred and fifty. Three hundred. A thousand. A million. Tape script four point fourteen. One and a half. Two and a quarter. Six point eight. Seventeen point five. O two o seven four eight one six four nine o. O seven eight six one. Five double six seven eight. Tape script four point fifteen. One. There are thirty students in my class, seventeen boys and thirteen girls. Two. I live at number sixty-two Station Road. My mobile number is. O seven six two nine, three double four eight o. Three. My father works in a big hotel. There are four hundred and sixty rooms on sixteen floors. Four. The population of my town is two hundred and eighty thousand. Tape script four point sixteen. Numbers and prices. One. How much is this book? Six pounds fifty. Two. How much are these pictures? Twenty-four pounds each. Three. I only earn eighteen thousand pounds a year. Four. How much is this car? Nine thousand five hundred pounds. Five. Just this postcard, please. That sixty p, please. Six. Can I have these jeans, please? Sure, that's forty nine dollars. Seven. How much is a return ticket from Paris to Madrid? A hundred and fifty euros. Eight. There are about one point four dollars to the euro. Unit four, exercise six, reading text. The Malmaison Hotel, Oxford. If you want a hotel in the centre of the historic English city of Oxford, try the Malmaison. The hotel is an old prison. The outside looks like an old building, but the inside is very modern. A lot of the hotel still looks like an old prison. The windows and doors, for example, the entrance and reception look like something from a horror film. 
There are ninety-four rooms. Many of the rooms are old cells. Three old cells make one big luxurious bedroom. And don't worry, they give you a key. The rooms are very comfortable and modern. There is a TV, CD and DVD player, free tea and coffee, and free internet access in every room. The bathrooms are beautiful, with a big bath and a huge shower. There is a fabulous bar on the third floor. The ceiling is very high. The windows are enormous, and the walls are black. There is a lot of interesting furniture and artwork to look at. Downstairs, there is a very good restaurant called the Brasserie, where the food is excellent and not too expensive. There is also a gym. The hotel is near all the university colleges and the beautiful romantic river Isis. There are also more restaurants and bars nearby, and a lot of shops. It's the kind of hotel you don't want to leave. Unit four, exercise seven, parts one and two. Gabrielle from the south of France. I live with my son and my grandson. We live in a small village called Tarascon near Avignon in the south of France. The house is very old and very big. We only live in part of it. There are six bedrooms, but we only use three of them. Most of the time, we live in the kitchen. It's a big kitchen. We eat and watch TV in there. We don't use the living room very much. That's big too. <laughs> My son Christophe is a builder. He's divorced. My grandson Laurent is only nine. He goes to school in the village. Kelly from Perth, Australia. I'm very excited because I have my own house for the first time. It's a bungalow and it's very new and modern. I have three bedrooms, a big living room and kitchen, and a small garden. I love it. I love cooking in my kitchen for my friends. It's in a part of Perth called Greenwood, not too far from the city centre. I work in a bank right in the centre, and I go to work by train. I live alone. Well, that's not quite true. I live with my cat Ozzy. He's my best friend. Najendra and Anita from Delhi, India. We live in a small flat with our daughters Alicia, she's thirteen, and Shristi, she's fifteen. The flat isn't in the centre of Delhi. It's west of Delhi, twenty kilometres from my work and the children's school. It's old and simple. We have one bedroom, one living room, and a tiny kitchen. The television's in one corner of the living room, and the fridge is in the other corner. Our kitchen is too small for a fridge. We sit on the floor to watch TV and eat our evening meal. The girls sleep here too. My wife and I sleep in the bedroom. Unit four, exercise eight. Part one. A. Fifteen. B. Seventy. C. Sixty-eight. D. Twenty. E. Two hundred and sixty. F. Eight hundred and ten. G. Two thousand. H, fifteen thousand. Unit four, exercise eight, part three. A, three hundred and eight. B, fifty one. C, twenty eight. D, six hundred and seventy. E. One thousand five hundred. F. Two and a half. G. Ten point three. H. O three nine seven eight double three six seven two one. Unit four, exercise nine, part one. 
A. Fifty pounds. B. Ten pounds. C. Six pounds fifty. D. Eighty p. E. One hundred euros. F. Eighty six euros. G. Forty five dollars. H. Twenty dollars.